Merry Christmas, guys. Hope you all had a great one and were able to spend it with family and friends and got everything you wanted. Um, Santa Claus was especially good to me this year, and uh, he brought me the brand new HD Hero 3 Black Edition. Now, this is not going to be a full-blown review of this camera. Just wanted to give you a quick look at the new camera. Just for fun, I've lined up here all of the uh, GoPro cameras that have been created, I think. I think I've got them all. Uh, starting with the very first GoPro camera, which wasn't even HD, I think it was 640x480 or maybe 720 but at the time it was an awesome camera, really useful, I just used it a ton. Um, then they came out with the HD Hero, which was awesome because it actually did HD quality video and everybody really, really liked that camera. Uh, more recently, they came out with the HD2, which this is really the go-to the go camera for RC filming. I mean, it just really is incredibly useful. It's got great quality. It's small and light. You can mount it on a helicopter or an airplane or a boat or a car, anything you want. Uh, it takes great video, great still frames, really is the go-to camera for RC filming. And whenever I'm filming RC, I'm with almost every RC video that I make, I'm using multiple of the HD2 cameras to get all the angles and all the action and all the great scenes. So it really is a great camera. So now, just a couple months ago, they came out with the HD Hero 3 Black Edition. There's actually a couple different editions. The Black Edition is special in that uh, it has the highest or the largest number of features and capabilities and the highest resolution and speed. So the HD Hero 2 was really the go-to camera for RC until the Hero 3 came out. So if you take everything that the HD Hero 2 is capable of, the HD 3 is that plus more. It is 30% smaller, so it's uh, thinner than the HD 2. It's 25% lighter, so it's easier to mount on smaller vehicles or planes, airplanes, helicopters, boats, whatever. And more importantly, it's faster. It's two times as fast as the HD Hero 2. So that means that you can take faster video, you can take uh, quicker still frame captures, and on top of all that, they've added this in, the capability to be a Wi-Fi hotspot. So this camera, as small and tiny as this little block of electronics is, not only is it an incredibly high quality camera, but it also has a Wi-Fi built into it. You can download a little app on your smartphone or tablet. You can control this camera, turn it on and off, change all the settings, whatever you want, and even more importantly, you can actually view the preview of what this camera is looking at from your smartphone. So when you mount this camera someplace, it's not always easy to tell exactly what it's pointing at or what's in frame, but with this preview feature, you can look at your smartphone or your tablet, you can see exactly what the camera is pointing at so you know you're going to get the exact correct picture in frame when you take your picture or you take your video. Extremely useful feature and I really like that, it's really cool. So once again, this is not going to be a full-blown review of this camera because I really just haven't had time to go through all the features and capabilities and all the cool stuff that this camera can do. But I did want to give you a first quick look. Also, it snowed a couple of days ago, and I took the HD Hero 3 out in the snow with an RC truck and took some video so you can get uh, a feeling for the incredible kinds of video that this can take and the cool uh, shots that you can get with the new HD 3. So once again, Hero 3 Black Edition, awesome camera, and here's some video from it for you.
Just look me in the eyes and say I'm wrong